is Lauren Salco. I am from New York City, and I am currently living in Park City, Utah, pursuing ski cross. I was actually feeling pretty good. There were no noticeable symptoms, except that I had been peeing quite a bit, although I only noticed that looking back now. So I was actually diagnosed on a well visit, so I went in for a yearly physical and was told that my blood sugar was slightly elevated, but that it was really nothing to worry about. And then a week later, I was referred to an endocrinologist who informed me that it was in fact something to worry about. They decided to run some tests to see what type of diabetes I had and it came back that I wasn't producing enough insulin, so I have type 1 diabetes. I heard about riding on insulin, actually the first time I heard about it was online and one of my best friends from college who I skied with was working at Mount Hood Summer Ski Camps and Sean Busby was on the website of Mount Hood Summer Ski Camps. I texted her immediately and said, if Sean Pusby's there, I need to meet him. Um, I have type 1 diabetes too, and this would just be so cool. Literally the next day, I was getting ready to go skiing up here at Mount Hood because I was in the area with, for an internship. And I saw people with shirts that said riding on insulin. And I wasn't really sure how to approach them. So I proceeded to take out all of my diabetes paraphernalia and lie it out on a table and hope that one of them stopped by and said something to me. Luckily, one of the other elite coaches, Mike Avery, stopped by, and I met Sean and Molly and spent the rest of the weekend hanging out with everyone from Riding on Insulin. Fast forward to March of that year when I emailed Molly and said I really want to get involved. So I volunteered at the Pennsylvania camp and then was asked to be an elite coach and came back out to Oregon for my first coaches camp. My learning to ski happened a lot differently than a lot of people. I transferred to boarding school when I was in 10th grade, and I, that's where I learned to ski race. You don't need to be young to learn to ski at all. I, to, because I didn't learn until I was older, I actually think that that helps me when I teach other people how to ski, because I very vividly remember those first few days and how they don't always come easy to everybody. I had seen ski racing on TV during the Olympics and decided that I wanted to be Bodie Miller, so I needed to learn to ski race. I thought I already was skiing as well as Bodie Miller. Turns out I had a lot to learn, but I was fortunate enough to get the coaching I needed so that I raced successfully in college and am pursuing skiing here on out.